Morning everyone, hope you're good. We are here for day four of our Inspire Centre growth and I am so excited. Um, today is going to be a little bit fun. It's all been fun actually, but this is just a little creative fun for you to go off and do. Um, no social media posts today. Um, you're on your um, day four and yesterday we were looking at, I've completely gone mind blank what we were looking at yesterday, um, what were we doing yesterday, social media stories, that was it, so we were looking at stories yesterday, sharing your lifestyle, the sensory role, a life in the day of, all those kind of things on your stories, um, upcoming things, family stuff, um, really getting people to know, like and trust you using your stories, so keep that going, um, that's something you want to do every day, um, and obviously it's two days since we did the post around um, sharing the opportunity on social media every two days so hopefully today some form in your group you will be sharing that again um, and again put any um, examples screenshots of that in day two's post and keep that thread going um, because people will come back and use that as inspiration as well as you can too so that would be fab but today 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 um, today is fun um, it's a little link to another day coming up at some point um, but it is just a little fun way of getting creative and sharing a message so today we won't be sharing the message we'll be working on it and then we'll be sharing the message later on so what I want you to do today is think about what Sensi means to you. Um, we have this conversation regularly so it shouldn't be too hard to come up with a one or two word um, feeling of how you feel about Sensi or what it gives you um, what you love about it, whatever it is. Um, it can be things like confidence, um, it could be friendship, it could be family, it could be freedom, um, self-belief, um, dreams, goals, whatever it is to you, whatever it means to you. I want you to summarise it in one or two words because you're going to have to fit it onto an A4 piece of paper and the creative side is to make it a pretty image now those that are in the recruitment focus groups that we did before will have done this but I want you to do it again whether it's a different word or a different creative way of doing it um, it's up to you but I want everyone to do it again because we are going to have something coming up next week that this is going to be for so it's really important to do it um, and it's really fun and it's just like a really lovely way of getting the team and everyone going so it's just a fabulous thing to do so I want you to go and do you could do like bubble art you could use you don't have to draw it you could or like write it really I suppose but you don't have to do that you can go and do it on word or an app or whatever else and then print it out on a4 paper it needs to be clear so that we can see it so it needs to be big across the page so that's why only one or two words um, and then you can like it doesn't have to just be the word you could like doodle or whatever else some scentsy wax or whatever if you're playing around with it and um, be as creative as you want but make sure that word really pops out of the page and really stands out um, and then we'll come back to that and why next week um, but yes do that please and then if you can screenshot no if you can take a selfie holding the image and this is where you're gonna have to play around with clear bright imagery Today might not be the day to get the best photo where you are here, it's a bit gloomy. Um, but get a selfie, um, a really bright, clear one. Um, if it's not too bright and you're not sure about playing with settings and lights and stuff, I can always edit it and make it um, a bit brighter, so don't worry too much. But if you can try and get that image in a really bright, clear space, good background, so either some Scentsy products behind you that are bright or just a plain background, um, not too cluttered. We really want the focus to be on your face and the word so we want the rest to just be bright and light to really show it up um so if you can do that and then add that selfie into the comments of the post that i'll put up after this so i'll put a few notes in there like i normally do and then you can just add that into there but this is going to be fun and it's going to show that we're a family we're a community that we're working really well together um and that it means so many different things to different people however I don't want everyone having the same word. So the challenge is in this live, before you go off and do it, comment your word. And then if you're watching this back on replay, which I know most of you will be, check this 
comment thread first before you go and do your word and then put your word and then go off and do it just so that we don't have loads of people saying the exact same thing you could say it in a different way so if um, someone put confidence and that was the word that you really wanted then you could just use a thesaurus and choose a different word that means a similar thing um, or just pick something else you know another word that it does mean to you because we want to get a range of different words and there's a reason for that so just trust me with that one um, and those that have done the Facebook group know what I'm talking about um, but I just want to keep it until next week so um so don't let the cat out of the bag um but yes we want to have loads of different words loads of different meanings so just make sure you comment your word on this live before you go off and do it um, as soon as you comment your word if no one else has picked it obviously and you're the first person to do that word you can go straight off and get on with the task um but make sure you comment it before you do it and that you check um, everybody else is on here first just so we've got a range um, obviously I don't want you going off and making something really beautiful um, Laura's already in there um, <laughs> um, but I, I don't want someone spending ages and ages and ages on something beautiful and then come back and see that someone else has done the same word so just be mindful so confidence has gone by the way guys because Laura's nabbed that one already <laughs> um, but yes um, check the comments and just go from there and then go off and do your arty creative fun um just have a little doodle today it's, it's great actually because it's a nice little like take 10 minutes out to just do this um you can just have a nice little music in the background and just let your creative juices flow on an apple or a pen um and just have a little bit of time out for you as well because drawing or playing around with stuff like this it's really therapeutic so enjoy that today that's all you've got to do today um, and I need it done by Sunday at the latest with the photo because I know that you guys some of you might be having you know might feel poorly today you might be having a PJ day and that's totally fine that's what this business is about so you've got until Sunday to get the um, selfie done okay because then one of the days next week we're going to be using it so just have it done by Sunday please and I don't want to be chasing everybody for it because I hate doing that so just please 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 by Sunday that would be amazing it'll make next week work really smoothly and I won't have to juggle things around so you've got um what is it say Thursday so you've got Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday to get that image done so you could work on it today and then print it off and then you could choose the best day of lighting as well so if it's sunny tomorrow and it's easy to get a picture then obviously that would work really well um and obviously you can share the picture that you've done if you want to share what you've actually done um and, and do the selfie another day but just have the selfie with that image so whether it's selfie and you're doing it yourself or you get someone to do it because we need to get the picture in with your face so don't cover your face have it below your face kind of like here um i haven't got a4 but you know like kind of like this that's what the kind of thing we want um so that it's clear and confident with your face and the message behind it as well so it has that real impact so is that right I hope that's all right. I hope it makes sense. Any questions, put them in the comments here um, and then I'll do the separate post for your images um, in this unit. So we're on day four, so that'll be unit five. So yes, have a fab day and I will speak to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.